Well, hey, welcome back to Next Trekking Adventure. Shh, we're gonna take you to a secret beach today. All the locals know about it, but since you're gonna probably be visiting the island, you may not know about it. So we're tracking our track, and we're gonna share with you how to get here. It's an amazing beach, and to locate it, it's uh, by the Governor's Beach House. So follow along and come along our journey. Come along with us and have some fun. Well, hey, welcome back to Next Trekking Adventure. And if you haven't followed us, we are full-time travelers. We travel both in our RV and outside of our RV, and we spent about three and a half months in Puerto Rico. So we wanna share our adventures with you. Follow along, we're gonna take you to three must-dos while in Fajardo, Puerto Rico. This is the perfect beach, Seven Seas Beach. We're gonna start our day off here. Right there where the cursor's at is Seven Seas Beach. So our first of three stops is going to be at Seven Seas Beach and we want to show you where to go so you can snorkel. There's plenty of area on Seven Seas Beach that you can just lounge and sit in the sun, but on the other side is the snorkel area and you can also sit on the beach there as well and there's some shade. We're going to show you that and then we're going to take you to a couple other places. And wait to pee until we're done. That's all the further they want to go. And I think, I think what he, do I have to do? Yeah. Oh, wait, wait to pee yeah. till we're done? Oh. Uh, I thought we were going in further. All right, here we go. <laughs> Hold it. My tab is just all messed up. Oh, no. Party okay. tab. All right. One, two, three. Okay, so here's your pro tip. So right where the paddle board is going through right now, on the other side of her is an orange buoy. And if you're at Seven Seas Beach, where the coral's at, is they've actually dropped that orange buoy, so you know where to snorkel to. So what we're gonna do is, now that we're cooled off a little bit, we were sweaty, grumpy, a little hangry. <laughs> Terry, Terry actually scratched me. But we're going to go out there and we're going to snorkel and we're going to bring you guys along and show you some of the coral and some of the fish out there. And if we're really, really lucky, we're going to look for turtles. But we're going to have to be really, really lucky. Okay, see you in the water. So on the right side of Seven Seas Beach is the snorkeling area. It's a little grassy out there, but there's a buoy out there where you can find some coral reef and a lot of fish. You'll also see a lot of fish and turtles on your way out. And since you're in the area, it would behoove you to take a little walk down to Playa Escadita or Secret Beach. You're just going to follow the beach line to the west and then there's a trail at the end of the beach that will take you through the jungle out onto the beach. Alright, well we're going to take you guys out with us. We're going to secret beach <laughs> a secret beach that everybody knows about but if you're visiting the island you probably won't know about it so we're going to take you with us we're going to show you the track
When you make your way through the jungle and you come out on the beach, you come out to powdery sugar sand. It's fantastic to walk on. Kick your sandals off and walk down the beach. The further west you go on the beach, the less crowded it is. The less crowded it is, the less clothes there are, if you know what I mean. But that's okay, because you'll have your own beach to yourself. And if you want to take your clothes off, take your clothes off. Just don't get caught by the policia. Full disclosure, it is a little bit of a hike out here. It's about three quarters of a mile, maybe a mile, uh, depending on how far you walk down the beach, how far you want to get away from people. But it is totally worth it. So when you get here, you are hot. We made it and uh, we got set up. It is rough out here, but don't let this deter you because this is very unusual. But see that little hole right there? It's nice and calm. What do you think? We made it. I say we take, well, you can't, you can't run into the water and go under because you have drink. Oh, I can. Because okay. you can hold it. Okay. Ready? Is everybody ready to jump in the ocean? Let's go. I'm hot and sweaty. We We're going to jump in the ocean. Let's go. Off. Okay, well after a full day of snorkeling, sitting on the beach, hiking, you're gonna wanna eat something and you're gonna wanna find some place to hang. And we've got the perfect place. It's the kiosks in La Hul. It's a short drive down the road from Seven Seas Beach and you can find just about anything you want there. Okay, so our second stop for today is in uh, the kiosks. So this is in the hill. The hill. And uh, the famous kiosks. So we're gonna take you guys down and show you all the restaurants. And do some shopping. Oh Lord, this is gonna cost me money. <laughs> Never mind, you're not gonna get to see the kiosks. We're getting back in the car and going. <laughs> As you can see, it's, it's pretty uh, busy. We're gonna show you the beach. It's a good beach to hang out on. That turquoise water, white sand. All right, let's go. Let's go. There is a beach side and a road side of the kiosks. Most of the shopping is on the road side. So if you're looking for knickknacks, souvenirs, those type of things, it's all gonna be on that road side. But there are bars and restaurants that face the ocean and they're fantastic. That is a gorgeous view there. But you know, I said souvenirs and knickknacks, and you know if there's souvenirs and knickknacks, Miss Terry's gonna be hitting the stores. Sandra? <laughs> There's no, yeah, there's no beach shells in here or coral for Sandra <laughs> to load in. <laughs> what kind of trouble are you getting into in here? Oh, yeah, there you go. Yeah. <laughs> we never know what she's doing. She's always doing crazy stuff. We're all, we're all I'm finding, I'm trying to find followers. I'm going to have to take a job 
just to support Terry's shopping habit. She wants to send the kids stuff. That's the question. Okay, so what do you guys think of Puerto Rico? Beautiful. Love it, and we have awesome tour guides. Yeah. Absolutely. They are taking us to all the perfect spots, showing us everything. Snorkeling. In fact, yeah. I'm I'm even gonna probably want to cancel some of the excursions because we've got our own tour guide. It's so awesome. I'm kind of a big deal on the island. <laughs> I'm kind of I'm yes. I'm seriously kind of a big deal. Why? Uh, yes, you are, and I'm buying you two XL shirts too. Oh. Oh. And of course, after that comment, we're going to go eat dinner. But we're not going to take you guys along with us. We're going to show you where we ate, but nobody wants to watch a fat guy eat. Thank you for watching. We really appreciate it. Follow our adventures. We are full-time travelers, full-time RVers. We go all over the country and to the tropics. Subscribe if you haven't already. Smash that like button. And we'll see you on our next trekking adventure.